good morning <coughs> this class uh, uh, we are going to discuss about linear differential equation with variable coefficients linear differential equations with variable coefficients So, so we can say it also eyeless differential equation with very variable coefficients. We can say that it is eyeless. Let t is equal to log x. Let t is equal to log x. T t by dx is equal to 1 by x. T t by dx is equal to 1 by x. In constant in uh, in previous uh, problems, that is a linear uh, differential equation with constant coefficient. Let us say what we have taken is d is equal to d by dx. Here, let d dash let t dash is equal to d by dt. T dash is equal to d by dt. Okay, this is most important. Now, dy by dx is equal to dy by dt into tt by dx. tt dt will be cancelled, therefore you will be getting dy by dx. Okay, this is equal to dy by dt is equal to d dash y. d by dt is d dash, therefore d dash y into dt by dx is equal to 1 by x 1 by x ok so therefore x into dy by dx equal to d dash y x into if we are x into dy by dx is equal to d dash y so this implies x into d by dx equal to d dash x into d by dx is equal to d dash x into d by dx is equal to d dash ok so therefore x into d by dx is equal to d dash this is most important then this is nothing but uh, <coughs> then d by dx actually d squared y by uh, here this is nothing but dy by dx x into dy by dx is equal to x into dy by dx is equal to dy by dt dy by dt ok x into dy by dx is equal to this is nothing but d by dt into dy ok now differentiating this differentiating with respect to x differentiating with respect to x x into d square y by dx square ue method x into d square y by dx square plus dy by dx into differentiation of x is 1 so now differentiating this with respect to x so this is a function of t differentiating with respect to we have to, do, we have to differentiate this with respect to x so therefore differentiating this function of function d square y by dt square into this is a function of t again t is differentiating with respect to x ok so therefore O is a function of t, then t is also a function of x, a function of function, first differentiating this with respect to x and the, but t is also again uh, differentiating, first differentiating with respect to t and differentiating with respect to x. So this is nothing but, so here uh, t t by dx is equal to again 1 by x, again 1 by x. So therefore x into 
d square y by dx square dx square uh, uh, this is nothing but x you this is 1 by x therefore x square into d square y by dx square plus x into dy by dx x into dy by dx equal to d square y by d d square which is equal to d square y by d d square So therefore, this is nothing but x square into d squared y by dx squared d squared y by dx squared plus x into dy by dx is equal to plus d dash y plus d dash y which is equal to d by dt is d dash d dash is equal to d by dt d dash square is equal to d by dt the whole square that is d square by t d square okay so therefore this is nothing but d dash square t dash square into y d dash square into y so therefore x square into d square y by d x square equal to d dash square y minus d dash y this is equal to d dash square minus t dash into y. This is equal to d dash into d dash minus 1 into y. So this is nothing but x square into d squared y by dx square. Okay. So therefore this is equal to x squared into d by dx square d square by dx square is equal to d dash into d dash minus 1. Okay, so therefore x into dy by dx x into d by dx is equal to d dash x square into d square by dx is equal to d dash into d dash minus 1. So that these two things are most most important for solving the differential equation with variable coefficient. Okay. The problem number one solve x square into d squared y by dx square minus 6x into dy by dx plus 12y equal to 0. Plus 12y is equal to 0. Solution. Okay. Now, this is the differential equation with variable coefficient. Here is not constant coefficient. Here is variable coefficient. So now let x squared into d squared by dx squared is equal to uh, we know that we know that this is equal to d dash into d dash minus 1 and x into dy by d by dx equal to simply d dash. You apply it here. So this is d dash into d dash minus 1. So we will take out y minus 6 into d dash minus 6 into d dash plus 12 into y equal to 0 into y is equal to 0. So therefore d dash square minus d dash minus 6 d dash plus 12 into y equal to 0. So therefore t dash squared minus 7 d dash plus 12 into y equal to 0. So the, now this is the differential equation with constant coefficient. 
but it is a function of t d dash is a function of t d dash is a function of t t already where put let t is equal to what here here let t is equal to lag x let t is equal to lag x e power t is equal to x e power t is equal to x so therefore after um, um, finding the solutions then you have to replace this t by lag x this t by lag x so therefore now the axillary equation is now the axillary equation is m square minus 7m plus 2m is equal to 0 so therefore m minus 3 into m minus 4 equal to 0 m minus 3 into m minus 4 is equal to 0 so therefore uh, m is equal to 3 or m is equal to 4 m is equal to 3 or m is equal to 4 so therefore 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 the complementary function is equal to therefore the complementary function is equal to c1 into e power 3t you know because t dash is a function of t 3t plus c2 is nothing but e power 4t now that t is replaced by lag x e power 3 lag x therefore lag x is a whole cube therefore e power lag x that means what e power 3 lag x this is equal to e power power rule of logarithmic x cube if exponential and log are inverse functions that will be cancelled therefore you will be getting x power 3 so therefore c1 into x power 3 plus c2 into x power 4 therefore the complementary function is equal to c1 into x power 3 plus c2 into x power 4 ok then <coughs> the particular integral is equal to then the particular integral is equal to here, here we, the right hand side is 0 so therefore there is no particular integral so therefore there is no particular integral the complementary function is nothing but the solution the general solution is y is equal to c1 into x cube plus c2 into x power 4 c2 into x power 4 so this is the required solution for the given differential equation because the right hand side of this equation is the function of x is equal to 0 there is, therefore there is no particular integral so therefore the complementary function is nothing but a general solution <coughs> problem number 2 problem number 2 x square d square minus 2xd x square d square minus 2xd x square d square minus 2xd minus 4 into y minus 4 into y which is equal to x square plus 2 lag x x square plus 2 lag x x square plus 2 lag x Solution This d is nothing but d by dx Therefore d squared is nothing but d square by dx square d square by dx square So therefore here let t is equal to lag x Let t is equal to lag x And x square d squared is equal to d dash into d dash minus 1 where d dash is equal to d by dt d by dt and xd is equal to d dash xd is equal to d dash so therefore the differential equation becomes d dash into d dash minus 1 d dash into d dash minus 1 minus 2 times of d dash minus 2 times of d dash 
minus 4 into y equal to so everything we converted uh, into a function of t this is also x squared is nothing but e power 2t because x is equal to rt x squared is equal to e power 2t plus 2 times of t log x is equal to t okay so then i can write d square d dash square minus d dash minus 2 d dash minus 4 into y is equal to e power 2t plus 2t therefore d dash square minus 3 d dash minus 4 into y which is equal to e power 2t plus 2t okay so now we can solve it now this is the differential equation with constant coefficients now we know that how to solve it okay now how to solve it uh, it is equal to the actionary as, as usual the actionary equation is m square minus 3m minus 4 is equal to 0 okay 1 into 4 therefore m minus 4 m plus 1 into m minus 4 therefore 1 into 4 minus 4 minus 4 plus 1 is minus 3 which is equal to 0 this implies m is equal to minus 1 and m r m is equal to 4 m is equal to 4 so therefore the complementary function is equal to therefore the complementary function is equal to e power minus t c1 into e power minus t plus c2 into e power 4t c2 into e power 4t therefore again i can write this is equal to e power minus t is equal to 1 by uh, e power minus t is equal to so this is equal to e power minus x power therefore this is equal to 1 by x c1 into 1 by x c1 into 1 by x plus c2 into x power 4 therefore c1 into 1 by x therefore complementary function is equal to c1 into 1 by x plus c2 into x power 4 c2 into x power 4 ok so therefore particular integral is equal to so here we have uh, two functions so for, uh, therefore particular integral 1 and particular integral 2 particular integral 1 is equal to 1 by 1 by d dash square minus 3 d dash minus 4 into x square x square is nothing but e power 2t e power 2t ok this is equal to e power 2t so therefore this is equal to this is very simple because d dash is replaced by 2 so therefore 1 divided by uh, 4 uh, minus 6 minus 4 into e power 2t into e power 2t so therefore this is equal to minus 1 by 6 into e power 2t therefore minus 1 by 6 into e power 2t so therefore particular integral 1 is equal to minus 1 by x into e power 2t particular integral 2 is equal to again 1 by d dash square minus 3 dash 4 into uh, 2 log x that is nothing but 2t 2t so here what we have to do is we have to take minus 4 out we have to take minus 4 out so therefore this is nothing but 1 minus half then 1 minus half uh, minus into minus plus therefore d dash square minus 3 d dash by 4 by 4 into 2t if you multiply it you will be getting minus 4 here then minus into minus plus d dash square then minus into minus into minus and then again minus 3d dash good so therefore again which is equal to 
again which is equal to so therefore 1 by minus 4 into 1 minus t dash square by 4 minus 3d dash by 4 the whole power minus 1 the whole power minus 1 into 2t the whole power minus 1 into 2t therefore this is equal to 1 by minus 4 into 1 minus x whole power minus 1 1 minus x the whole power minus 1 is equal to 1 plus x plus x square plus x etc etc so therefore this is equal to 1 plus x x is nothing but d dash square by 4 minus 3 d dash by 4 1 plus x plus x square x square term you will be getting everything d dash is power 4 d dash therefore automatically so this becomes the other terms will be neglected because all the powers is more than uh, 2 but the uh, the second uh, that is d dash square of 2t becomes 0 ok so therefore we neglect all other terms into 2t ok clear the next term will be first the next term d dash square by 4 minus 3 d dash square the whole square is equal to t power 4 then t power 3 then d dash is per square so everything will be 0 so therefore this is equal to minus 1 by 4 into 2t 1 into 2t 2t d square of 2t becomes 0 minus 3 by 4 into minus 3 by 4 into d dash d, d dash is the differentiation of 2t is equal to 2 ok so therefore this is equal to minus 1 by 4 into so this will become 2 so 2 log x plus 2 log x minus 3 by 2 2 log x minus 3 by 2 so therefore this is particular capital 2 so therefore the general solution is therefore the general solution is therefore the general solution is y is equal to complementary function plus particular integral complementary function plus particular integral complementary function is equal to uh, c1 into 1 by x plus c2 into x power 4 plus particular integral 1 is equal to minus 1 by 6 into e power 2t e power 2t is nothing but uh, I can write e power 2t is equal to x square so e power 2t is equal to x square then minus 1 by 4 then minus 1 by 4 into 2 log x minus 3 by 2 so which is the required general solutions solution for the given differential equation given differential equation ok ok minus x square by 6 of x by 2 plus 3 by 8 ok good <coughs> plus 3 by 8 ok ok good so therefore the one more problem the last problem is solve the differential equation Solve the differential equation. Solve the differential equation. X square d square. X square d square minus x d plus four. X square d square minus x d plus four into y is equal to into y is equal to x square sine of log x. X square sine of log x sin of log x this is also important problem 
solution let t is equal to log x as usual and x square d square is equal to d dash into d dash minus 1 x d is equal to d dash where d dash is equal to d by dt d dash is equal to d by dt and e power t is equal to x e power 2 t is equal to x square and all so therefore that uh, differential equation becomes d dash into d dash minus 1 minus x d is equal to d dash plus 4 into y equal to x square x square is nothing but e power 2 t psi t e power 2 t psi t e power 2 t psi t okay so now d dash square d dash square minus t minus t minus 2 d dash plus 4 okay into y equal to e power 2 t into psi t e power 2 t into psi t so therefore the axillary equation is m square minus 2 m plus 4 is equal to 0 okay therefore here is minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4 ac that is minus 16 divided by 2 okay this is equal to m therefore m is equal to therefore m is equal to 1 plus or minus 1 plus or minus so this is uh, 12 4 into 3 so therefore 4 uh, root root will be cancelled so therefore root 3 i therefore root 3 i so therefore the complementary function is equal to therefore the complementary function is equal to I will write it now therefore complementary function is equal to therefore the complementary function is equal to e power alpha x therefore alpha t therefore e power t into c1 cos root 3t plus c2 sin root 3t sin root 3t e power t is equal to x x into c1 cos root 3 log x plus c2 sin root 3 log x you know, because we have to replace all t in terms of log x okay so therefore this is nothing but complementary function so complementary function is equal to what x into c1 cos root 3 log x plus c2 sin root 3 log x okay then particular integral is equal to 1 by the particular integral is equal to 1 by t dash square minus 2 d dash 2 dash square minus 2 d dash plus 4 into particular integral 2 is what sin of that is uh, e power t e power 2 t into sin t e power 2 t into sin t you now because x square log x x square log uh, sin log x x square of sin log x now now this is the product of uh, two functions you have to take e power 2 t out ok you have to take e power 2 t out ok you will be getting what this d dash is replaced by d dash plus 2 d dash is replaced by d dash plus 2 so d dash plus 2 the whole square minus 2 times of d dash plus 2 plus 4 into sin t into sin t ok because 
d dash is replaced by d plus 2 this is the rule so automatically e power 2t will come out then there will be sin t okay so therefore this is equal to e power 2t into 1 by 1 by d dash square plus 4 d dash plus 4 minus 2 d dash minus 4 plus 4 into sin t plus 4 minus 4 will be cancelled so therefore this can be written as e power 2t into 1 divided by d dash square ok 4 d dash minus 2 d dash plus 2 d dash plus 2 d dash plus 4 into sin t into sin t ok because t dash is replaced by d dash plus 2 ok d dash plus 2 minus 2 d dash t dash square plus 4 t d dash plus 4 minus 2 d dash minus 4 plus 4 ok so therefore therefore this is equal to e power 2 t into so what is that rule d dash squared is replaced by minus alpha squared that is here's minus 1 so therefore e power 2 d divided by 1 minus minus 1 plus 2 d plus 4 minus 1 plus 2 d dash plus 4 into sin t so this is equal to again e power 2 t 1 by 2 d dash is 2 d dash plus 3 again you have to multiply 2 d dash minus 3 divided by 2 d dash minus 3 multiply and divide so therefore into sin t so therefore this is equal to e power 2 t into 1 by 4 d dash square minus 9 into 2 d dash so 2 times of differentiation of sin t with respect to t cos t minus 3 sin t minus 3 sin t so therefore again I can write this is equal to e power 2 t into 1 by 1 by so therefore this again, this sin t is there, sin t is again replaced by this. So, therefore, this is nothing but again minus 1, therefore minus 1 minus 4 minus 13 minus 13 into 2 cos t minus 3 sin t minus 3 sin t. So, therefore, the general solution is. Therefore, the general solution is o is equal to complementary function plus particular integral so therefore o is equal to what is the complementary function e power uh, that is uh, uh, x into x into c1 cos root 3 log x 2 3 log x log x plus c2 into sin root 3 log x plus particular integral is nothing but minus uh, e power 2t e power 2t is nothing but x squared ok uh, x squared divided by x squared divided by minus plus that, that is minus x squared by 13 into 2 cos log x 2 cos log x minus 2 cos log x minus 3 sin log x 3 sin log x so therefore 3 sin log x so therefore this is nothing but uh, <coughs> particular integral so therefore complementary function is equal to x good so therefore which is the required solution for the
given differential equation. Thank you.